Today on Tracy's Basement, Marvel Collector Core. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to Tracy's Basement if you have never been here before. Today I have Marvel Collector Core, the Civil War box. Now you guys may have already seen a bunch of unboxings of this. This box took a long time to get here. Uh, this is not one of those situations where I was at West when it arrived. It actually only just arrived. I know a lot of other people have had the same problem. Don't know what's going on. It seems like some people got theirs right away and other people's were really, really delayed. Mine in particular, according to the tracking information, it sat in the processing facility for like 11 days. So that's really frustrating. But it's here. <laughs> so let's have a look at it, shall we? So as always, when you open it up, you have some cool artwork on the inside there. And the inner flap has a patch and pin that are in some way in tune with the theme of the box. So let's see what we've got here. So the pin is Black Panther. You can see Collector Core there. And the patch is Crossbones. So that's pretty cool. Cool start. These are in every box. Just little extra collectible things. And then you open the inside flap and that's where all the really cool stuff is. So right on the top, this is something that's not your, normally in Collector Core, but there's a little spoiler card that shows what's in the box and has some information about apparently what might have been in the box but didn't end up being there. So I'm just going to set this aside because we don't like spoilers. Then the first thing we've got is the t-shirt. I love these little t-shirts. Let's see what the Civil War one looks like. Okay, so this is pretty cute. It says, which side are you on? Captain America Civil War, and it's got the split there with Iron Man and all of his buddies in red, and Cap and all of his buddies in blue, in the Funko Pop uh, style. That's really cute. I like that a lot. Not bad at all. I know a lot of people don't like the Funko Pop t-shirts all that much, but I personally like them. And this is a really cute design for Civil War, so pretty awesome. Next we have a comic. It is a Black Panther comic, variant edition, with a Funko Pop cover on it. It's pretty cute. Black Panther coming down on top of Cap like that. It's pretty sweet. I like that. I'm not going to open that right now because it's all nicely packed and backed. <laughs> We've got a lanyard. The red bits have Iron Man on them and the blue bits have Cap and it says Civil War all through there. Pretty cute. I don't really get a whole lot of uses out of these lanyards, but I might take this to work and hang my uh, scan card off of it. Pretty cool. Here's some really fun stuff. We have a Dorbs, which is exclusive to the box, of course, and it is a little Dorbs Iron Man with the mask up, and it is super cute. <laughs> Let's take it out of the box and look at it. That is super cute. I love it. <laughs> I love little Tony Stark with his mask up and the Dorb is very nicely done. Nice paint job. There's like one or two little tiny things if you're really, really scrutinizing it, but very nicely made. I love this. This is so adorable. This is super, super cute. I'm actually getting a little bit more into the Dorbs lately. I'm not going to go crazy on them like I do with Pops, but I do really like them. They're so well painted and cute. And this is a super, super, super cute one. I love it. Look at his little goatee and everything. <laughs> That's awesome. And last but not least, we have a two-pack of exclusive uh, Funko Pops this month. It is a Cap and Iron Man two-pack. And they're in, like, fighting position, attacking each other. Pretty cute. Let's take a moment look. So we've got Cap standing with his shield up, head off to the side. And we've got Iron Man up in the air, aimed down, kind of uh, ready to shoot a repulsor blast. That's super cool. I like that idea. This is 
really nice as Iron Man. I love the pose. It's very dynamic. Cap, a little bit lazier. He's mostly just looking to the side and his shield is up. But together, they make a pretty cool pair. That's a really cool design. These are really cool. I really like the idea of having them in this position fighting each other because obviously civil war and everything. Uh, my only thing is, you know, this line has been a little bit milked. There are multiple other versions of both of these characters. Tons of exclusives all throughout the line. So while this was kind of obvious that they would do something like this for the Civil War box, I was actually kind of hoping that they might do something different with some of the other characters, you know. Uh, these are awesome. I love them. It was just a little bit too obvious, and with so many versions of them already, it would have been nice to see something a little bit different. So there you go, that was Marvel Collector Core, the Civil War box. Not bad at all, I did really like it. We got two exclusive pops and exclusive dorbs, a cute comic with a variant cover, the lanyard, and a really cute shirt that I like a lot personally. Overall, very nice box. I actually really, really like it. It was a very good box. I do kind of wish that they had us did something a little bit different for the pops, but those pops are pretty cool and I love how they're fighting each other, so that's pretty awesome. So anyway, if you are interested in Marvel Collector Core, there will be some information in the description box below. If you've enjoyed the video, please give me a thumbs up, share with your friends, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook at Tracy's Basement. Those links are in the description box below. And as always, guys, keep coming back for more Tracy's Basement. Hi. And this is the part where you guys can give me some love if you liked the video and you want to watch some more. Here are some of the more recent ones, and if you enjoyed the channel, please give me a big thumbs up, subscribe right below, please keep coming back for more videos. Bye!